Hey, what's up? So today I'll be working on my Rustler 4x4 and I'll be fixing the damage on it. I was showing my son how to drive it and this happened. <laughs> so the shock shaft right here broke right at the threads. I bought a new shock to replace it. This tie rod is also bent, but it's not broken so I'm just gonna go ahead and leave it until it does break. I have a new shock to replace this one, but I'm actually taking off all the blue parts, the shocks, and these right here, and that'll be going on a new project, and I'll be changing them out to the silver, and eventually I'll be getting a new body, and that's why I want to change out the blue, because it's not going to go with the paint job I want to do. So I'll start by removing the tires. So I'll be replacing these with the silver ones, so I'll go ahead and start doing that right now. Needs a little bit of heat, so I'm going to take this off this time instead of melting the arm. <laughs> so those are installed. I'll start on the front. The front have some inserts I have to go in here. I'm not going to swap out this hex because you won't be able to see it anyways. Alright, so I have these installed. I'll go ahead and start removing the shocks. I'll go ahead and start filling up these shocks. I'll be using some 30 weight.
Okay, so I have the oil in here. I'm going to go ahead and install the springs. And I'll have these adjusted to the same height they were before. All right, shocks are done, ready to go. I'll go ahead and install them now. All right, so that's all done, ready to go. I'm gonna leave it like this. I have one more upgrade I'll be doing. That'll be it for this video. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.